Selena Gomez and Hailey Bieber can't stop or won't stop with the drama, but if we're going to be honest, Hailey courts it quite a bit with the overt copying of Selena. Just saying. This is some serious cyberbullying behavior. Or is it? Well, according to all involved, nothing happened, but let's hit you with the facts. Back in February of 2023, Selena decided to post a TikTok that her eyebrows were over-laminated, which like, hooray for Selena for owning her mistakes, we guess. However, the very next day, Kylie Jenner, friend of Hailey Bieber, posted a pic of the eyebrow section of her face with the caption, This was an accident? Followed by a screenshot of Hailey's zoomed-in eyebrow while they were apparently FaceTiming. It's all a bit obvious that the models were full out making fun of Selena. But all parties involved, including Selena, have claimed that this fandom is making stuff up. Whether or not this fandom was extrapolating the fallout from this debacle has made Selena the the most followed person on Instagram. Schools clearly need to hire Selena Naders to teach bullies how to stop that trash because karma comes immediately. And as far as this being a time that Haley copied Selena, we're assuming that a post about her eyebrows would have never been a thing if Selena didn't do it first. You're not but a second-rate trying hard copycat. Well, here's a cringe moment of embarrassment if we've ever seen one. When you're as famous as Selena, the world will sometimes tell your story for you. In fact, there have been times when Selena has mentioned that she wanted to tell her own story and wish she could so people could see her heart. Literally stating that the one thing she wished people could see about her was her heart. Cut to Haley on The Tonight Show, revealing that she was glad that she was able to tell her own story as well. Haley again seemingly echoing Selena, stating, I I wish people just knew my heart. Okay, I'm starting to fear that Haley may be single white femaling Selena. Why are you so obsessed with me? Okay, so this one may be a bit of a stretch because both starlets are young, beautiful, and trendy AF. So, here is a world where Haley is copying trends, not Selena. That being said, one viral TikTok shows many side-by-side -side comparisons of Haley's and Selena's outfits. And let's just say, a lot of them look identical. Plus, her tattoo placement on her back basically mirrors Selena's tat. I'm not saying this evidence would hold up in court, but Haley girl, come on. Now, this copycat moment is brought to you by the letter J. Upon marrying Justin Bieber, the model skincare guru Hailey Bieber got a striking J tattoo on her finger. This would have been all well and good except for the fact that the front of the J looks exactly like the J ring Selena was given by Justin back in 2012. A yoikes! The ring itself was a simple silver design featuring a J in a cursive font and was believed to be a Valentine's Day gift from Justin to Selena while the pair were dating. Justin must take some responsibility in this mess sometime, right? Dang, uh... So back in the day when Haley was just a Baldwin and not a Bieber, it was found out by Selena Naders that Haley was caught following Jelena fan accounts in the past. And while Haley now denies, 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 the evidence mounting for her fandom is pretty undeniable. In 2018, screenshots show Haley started following the Instagram fan account at House of L. Haley unfollowed it and DM'd the owner to explain that it was an accident. When Haley was younger, she was seen at an event with a huge smile whilst holding up a magazine featuring Selena and Justin. More screenshots from 2011 to 2013 appear to show Haley tweeting about the Wizards of Waverly Place actress. Selena Gomez is so cute! The alleged screenshot shows she wrote this in 2011. On another tweet, she said, Selena Gomez is so friggin' good looking. And, I don't care what anyone says, but Justin Bieber and Selena Gomez together is the definition of a teenage dream. Hashtag word. Well, this is why you always delete your former tweets. Needless to say, fans pointing out all the copycatting has been an overwhelming time for Selena, and most likely Haley too. Due to the drama, the singer took to social media saying she's taking a break amidst all the speculation and rumors. After eyebrow gate, Selena said, And I'm 30, I'm too old for this, so. <laughs> but I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys sooner rather than later. I'm just going to take a break from everything. Looks like the best thing to do in a dramatic situation is to do nothing. Here's hoping that Selena keeps this zen outlook. 
Selena may be taking an L on the most recent dramas, but in the past, she wasn't always so minimalist. In October 2019, shortly after Selena Gomez released her track, Lose You to Love Me, speculated to be about her former romance with Justin, Haley shared an Instagram story listening to the song I'll Kill You by Summer Walker and Janae Aiko. Fans immediately connected the Insta story to the It Ain't Me singer's latest release, which Haley vehemently denied. But like the classy lady Selena is, she immediately posted, Please stop with the nonsense. There there is no response starting to think the truth lies somewhere in between. And this isn't the first time Selena has attempted to shut down all this nonsense of pitting Haley versus herself. In fact, she once told Cosmopolitan magazine that she does not stand for women tearing women down and I will never ever be by that. Of course our queen cell would support other women, even women who continually shade her on the socials. It's called being a boss, baby. While Selena keeps it classy, Haley is working her butt off trying to show the world that she's totes fine with Selena. And by butt, we mean like pressing her finger. In 2019, the New York native liked one of Gomez's posts about the launch of her rare beauty collection. In November of that year, a source claimed that Haley thinks Selena is talented by liking photos of Selena. Whether it be glam shot or ones that her friends post on Instagram, Haley wants to show that there are no hard feelings. Haley wanted to keep the peace in a low-key public way, which is nice and all, but keep in mind, this is before the eyebrow of all of it. Maybe we just have to assume Haley's take on the eyebrow stage was her proving that imitation was the serious form of flattery? And regardless of this mounting evidence of Haley copying Selena or hating Selena or whatever, Selena has had a history of slamming trolls even as far back as 2020. After Madison Beer, a mutual friend of the two, dined with Haley, some fans of Selena came down hard on Madison Beer due to their feelings that she betrayed Selena Gomez. Not only did Beer defend herself, but the Disney Channel alum came to her defense as well. Gomez wrote via Instagram, I'm so disappointed that people would speak to someone like this. I've known Madison since she was a baby and watched her continue to be become the woman she is. There is no issue. Fans, take note. But after all the work Selena does saying she's above all these rumors and the copycat instances, let's just say Selena gets down in the dirt sometimes too. On May 10th, 2022, Gomez shared a TikTok of her skincare routine that some fans assumed was her way of making fun of a video that Haley posted earlier that day. And when fans caught this faux pas, Selena immediately responded, saying, Guys, no idea what I did, but I really am sorry. Zero bad intention, deleting soon. The fans are always watching. So, we have gathered our evidence and it's not looking great for Haley or Selena. Oh boy, this is a mess. Which copycat moment struck your interest? Comment below. And for all the Jelena Selena drama, be sure to like and subscribe to The Things Celeb.